Stanley Tucci is counting his blessings since beating cancer. The Hunger Games star, who was diagnosed in 2017, said in a new interview that he is incredibly lucky to be alive after his initial scan did not pick up the tumor located at the base of his tongue. I had a scan, but the scan missed it. And of course, when you think that there might be something wrong, you're also afraid that there is something wrong. Tucci, who lost his first wife, Kate Spath, to breast cancer in 2009, told People magazine Wednesday. Eventually, a doctor discovered that Devil Wears Prada, stars 3cm, 1-inch tumor. They couldn't do surgery because the tumor was so big, Tucci, who first disclosed his cancer battle in 2021, explained. It's a miracle that it didn't metastasize. It had been in me so long. Tucci underwent a 35-day radiation treatment and seven sessions of chemotherapy, which decimated his senses of taste and smell. He was also left unable to eat, so he beat Felicity's undying attention, affection and encouragement got me through it, Tucci said of his wife. David M. Bennett after his treatments ended in 2018, Tucci started to regain his senses and ability to eat, which he described as, just the most exciting thing in the world, as it allowed him to explore his passion for food again. The cookbook author also credited his wife, Felicity Blunt, with getting him through the terrifying ordeal. Felicity's undying attention, affection and encouragement got me through it, he shared. Tucci and Blunt, who is the older sister of actress Emily Blunt, share son Matteo and daughter Amelia. The Searching for Italy host is also dad to twins Niccolo and Isabel, and daughter Camilla, with his late wife. E came dependent on a feeding tube.